In high school physics, math is just a tool, like your hammer or a screwdriver. In this course, I am going to show you how to use such a tool in the perspective of a physicist, meaning a practical perspective. This course contains three main sections. 1. Algebra for physics 2. Vector for physics 3. Trigonometry for physics The algebra section will show you how to rearrange equations easily. It contains two episodes only. The first one is the longest video of this course, about 25 minutes, and it is full of goodies. It will remind you what a mathematical term is and why this notion is important in regards to rearranging equations. The video will also refresh some useful notions on fractions. It will reflect too on the meaning of the equal sign. And then it dives in. You will learn how to rearrange equations super easily using reliable tricks and shortcuts. The video concludes with an exercise, isolating a variable in an equation involving energy. The second algebra video will train your new skills in rearranging a half dozen equations. These equations are taken from electric and magnetic fields, motion, oscillations and electric circuits. Note that you do not need to be familiar with these subjects to manage these exercises. You only need algebra. The vector section is composed of four videos. The first one discusses what a vector is and presents two ways of describing it using either Cartesian coordinates or polar coordinates. Converting a set of vector coordinates from one type to the other is incredibly common and useful in physics. This episode will show you how to do just that. Another operation on vectors that is crucial to master in physics is adding them to one another. The second video will show you how to do it graphically and algebraically. It is comprised of formal lessons and solved examples. The third video shows how the math about vectors presented in episode 1 and 2 come together. It shows you how to solve problems with vectors in one dimension and in two dimensions. The final video of this section is composed of two full exercises that involve vectors. The first exercise deals with electric charges and the second one with gravitational forces. Actually, your understanding of vectors will determine the survival of a spaceship lost in an asteroid field. Do not worry if you haven't seen electrical and gravitational fields in class yet. You do not need these notions to be able to solve these exercises. The trigonometry section is composed of five episodes. In the first one, we will start from the beginning by defining what an angle is and how to convert and manipulate angles. The second video is an introduction to trigonometry. What is a cosine? What is a sine? What is a tangent? And how to use these? This episode links these notions to the coordinates of a vector. You will see how everything starts to make sense with all pieces matching each other like a puzzle. The third episode is a set of applied physics exercises that blend trigonometric notions with vectors. Work on these exercises seriously. Follow the instructions in the video. If you do so, you will master the link between vectors and trigonometry. The fourth episode presents the unit circle, a notion you most certainly already heard about. In this video, I will show you how extremely useful this representation can be in physics. This episode is just full of tips. The last video of this course dives a little deeper in the unit circle. You probably know that the unit circle allows you to represent graphically the sine and cosine of an angle. But did you know that it can also represent the tan, the cotan, the sec and the cosec of this angle? This episode is slightly more advanced, but if you go through it, your understanding of trigonometry will be significantly reinforced. This course is aimed at students preparing for the International Baccalaureate, the A-Level, AP Physics, or any type of high school final exam in physics. I hope you will enjoy studying physics with me as much as I enjoy producing these videos. In the meantime, fasten your seatbelts and enjoy the ride! <laughs>